Hi, this is Dr. Darren Schmidt at the Nutritional Healing Center of Ann Arbor. And this lecture is a quick um, discussion on triggers versus risk factors versus causes. Okay, only one of these matters. It's the causes. This is the only thing that matters. So if you have a migraine, um, there are triggers for migraines. That might include chocolate or red wine or a certain smell. And yeah, you want to avoid triggers. And you could be avoiding triggers all your life for decades and decades. But if you don't get the cause, then you keep avoiding the triggers all the time. So um, we do a really good job of getting rid of migraines. Um, I love treating migraines. You either have it or you don't. And that's what makes it easy for me to see what the kind of results people get. Um, so the next one is risk factors. Let's talk about heart disease, heart disease a little bit. So... Risk factors for heart disease include obesity and smoking and um, inactive lifestyle. And, um, but there are causes for heart disease, and I have a couple of great videos on that. So there are people who are overweight, they smoke, and they sit on a couch all the time, and they don't ever get heart disease. So therefore, these risk factors don't really play a huge role in this with the cause. Now, there are people who don't smoke, they eat good food, they take their supplements and they exercise, and they have no risk factors, but yet they still have a heart attack. So I know a guy, he used to be an ultra-marathon runner, and um, he had a heart attack. He was thin, he was active, he was deficient in nutrients, which is, or he had certain genetic factors, okay? Either one of those are a cause. Deficiency of nutrients... Or these genetic factors those are causes but those are not risk factors so I just want to clear this up because this I have patients all the time asking me about this and they talk about these all the time risk and we have these discussions but I'm like trying to get them back to hey let's talk about causes this is the only thing that matters so um, there you go so You've probably heard these two terms before. You've probably had discussions with your medical doctor about these two things. But discuss this. If you're not discussing this, you're wasting your time. All right, so there you go. That's the truth.